I hope this has been helpful. To be honest, I genuinely want every single person that reads the book and goes through the course to get everything they want in strength and conditioning. For me, this is the most important legacy I can leave as a strength coach. I care less about what the world knows about me and more about what you think about me. And as I look through, how do I extend myself back? How do I give gratitude and give something back to the industry? It's about leaving a legacy. It's about leaving something that quite frankly, hopefully transforms and helps future strength coaches and maybe even current ones. The future of our industry, I want to be bright and optimistic. I don't want to be bleak and looked at as a dinosaur. I don't want to look 20, 30 years from now, all of us are selling real estate because either we couldn't hack it, we couldn't make it, or the field just dissolved. And I don't think that's necessarily this doomsday scenario. I think it's a growth opportunity that inflection points always will occur in every industry. We, as a strength conditioning staff, need to evolve, need to grow, need to blossom into something that transforms each iteration in us into something better. Every module in here, every single chapter in the book, to me is my homage to not only my journey, but future journeys. It's this look ahead, it's this look behind, it's everything and saying, I did it this way, I think you should do it this way, but it's just my attempt and opinion. And it's, at the end of the day, hopefully something that is of value. But that's really what we're doing here. It's talking in a very open forum about the hardships, the downsides. Everyone struggles with the same things. I talk to everyone. I talk to a lot of strength coaches. We're all dealing with the same problems, just interpreting it or handling it in different ways. And no one's got a perfect solution and no one's got the perfect plan. It's just a matter of context and circumstance and fighting the good fight to hopefully give yourself not only the life that you want, but life for those around you, our athletes, our coaches, our mentors, our future staff, our mentees, our family everyone's included in this circle and this ecosystem. And we should think about that as we're tra traversing our career, making choices, all the things that we talked about in this course. I hope you guys enjoyed. I got two next steps for you. Step number one, be getting on that curriculum. If you saw in every single module, I'd su suggested resources. This is a huge, huge amount of resources. It is a ton of information. It's 50 modules, it's 500 pages of written word, it's over 30 hours of actual audio and another 20 hours of video. And there's so much content in there. It's gonna take a lifetime to get through, but that's the point. It's evolving, growing, hopefully facilitating your growth and evolution as a strength coach. It's just about staying on there, getting on there, getting communicating on the forum. The other part is consults and workshops, audits, or even mentorships. All those options, I get a lot of requests, I get a lot of people asking for it. So if you like what I talked about here and you want it delivered in a more customized or individual manner, get on there and go through that. And I will make a customized experience for you to help you answer some questions or work through some things that you really wanna learn more about or grow with. So both of those options are at your disposal. Please, by all means, get through that. Uh, and reach out to me if you have any questions or any needs, because I'm here for you and I wanna help you in your journey. Thank you.